I'm often asked how long proceedings take. Now, with a divorce, that's straightforward to answer, at best four months, or maybe more. With financial proceedings, it can take it can take up to about 18 months in my experience. There are a sequence of hearings, so you have a first appointment, a financial dispute resolution hearing, and then a final trial if you haven't resolved the issue. And if you go to trial, final trial, in my experience, it can take up to around um, 14 to 18 months. Now, children proceedings are slightly more challenging. And the reason for that is that um, children proceedings might never end. I know that sounds slightly scary, but you could have a set of proceedings over contact residence um, of the children, and you may even re reach a resolution or a final order. But children change, circumstances change, and if you can't resolve how to move forward with the children as they grow, you may be in proceedings again. So I have seen cases, or colleagues of mine have seen cases, which have gone on for six, seven, eight, nine years. Just an awfully long time. So it's best to be sensible about proceedings, particularly in relation to children. So a dialogue is critical. It's really important that people can talk about how to deal with the children so you're not going back to court.